Uh, damn it! They just keep coming! What the hell's going on? Cerberus is a spellcaster of the highest caliber. For the one who developed Super Reincarnation, this is child's play. Cerberus, that damn mutt! Uh, uh, again? At a time like this? Prince Zed, you mustn't overexert yourself. That's right. Your repeated Super Reincarnations are tearing you apart. If you carry on like this, you'll kill yourself for good. Bubby's <gasps> gonna die? <laughs> no, Bubby! <laughs> You're so silly, Biko. Bubby's invincible. See? I'm perfectly fine. I'm detecting incoming enemy reinforcements! They just keep coming! I'm reading over 10,000 of them! Wh what did you just say? To 10,000? With numbers like that, I can possibly bribe all of them at once. Damn it. If things are this bad, then I at least need to get Biko out of... <laughs> What's wrong, Zed? I thought you lived by the words, never give up. You! Mr. Overlord! Indeed! I am undefeated, peerless, and the center of the universe. I am the one and only Overlord Ivar! This isn't good. Don't get too close to him, Biko. His stupidity is contagious. Hey, Mr. Overlord! Are you here to help Bubby? Thank you! <laughs> I did not come here for Zed's sake. I am here to help you, Biko. Now, Zed. Only the smallest of the small fries remain. Surely you can manage to handle that much weight as you are. Uh, nobody asked for your help. <laughs> if you wish, I, Overlord Ivar, am willing to join you and your comrades. <laughs> like hell I'd let you join us. I don't want my sister catching your stupidity. Hard-headed zombie! Now listen here! You may never have another chance to add me, Overlord Ivar, to your ranks. This is a limited-time, unprecedented, once-in-a-lifetime, two-birds-one-stone opportunity. Are you aware of that? My, my! It seems Overlord Ivar is absolutely desperate to join our little group! His heart must have been moved by Zed and Biko's tale. He has obviously become quite a fan. Mr. Overlord, please join us. I want you to help Bubby. B Biko! Oh, Biko! I shall gladly do whatever you ask. Clear a spot on your roster for Overlord Ivar! Woohoo! We did it! Prism Overlords entering the fray! We've got Prism Red, Prism Zed, Prism King, Prism Princess, Prism Magical, Prism Sis! And now that Prism Overlord is joining us, we've assembled all seven members of the Ultra Chroma Power Squad! <laughs> A true hero arrives fashionably. Prism Overlord arriving just in time! Whoa! You're actually going along with it? But of course, allow me to explain. When I prism Overlord and Mir Biko, my motivation increases a hundredfold! Let's go, Prism Rangers! I'll show you just how powerful Prism Overlord is! 
<laughs> He's totally into this crap. Is he really an overlord? It is oh, time to really stop parallel to Overlord Argon!
fantastic, Prism Overlord! I thought you were just some idiot, but you're actually really strong! <laughs> of course I am! I'm the strongest, most important, and most amazing Overlord in the universe! Oh, you're so cool, Mr. Overlord! <laughs> you really think so? Alright, I'll give it my all on behalf of Biko! Come at me, fools! What the hell is cool about this clown? You're starting to worry me, Biko. Hmm, between his looks and his brain, perhaps the presence of one is enough to highlight the absence of the other. Even his outfit exudes extraordinary levels of idiocy. His lack of intelligence goes without saying. He's clearly an idiot, no doubt about it. Stop calling me an idiot! I'm incredibly weird. You should show me more respect. <laughs> oh, are you having fun, Pico? Yeah, Bubby has really funny friends. I'm glad Bubby got to travel with such nice people. Yeah, and from now on, so do you. Really? <laughs> Pico's so happy! I thought I'd never get to make friends again. I broke lots of stuff and hurt lots of people. Pico wanted to just go away forever. Pico. Say no more. From now on, I, the wonderful Overlord Ivar, shall protect you. That's my line, damn it! Just get out of here already! Forget about all that stuff, Nico. It wasn't your fault. You were a victim, too. What? Just forget about it, okay? Cerberus is the bad guy. It's all his fault. I don't know your reasons for doing all this, Cerberus. But I'm going to make you pay for hurting Biko. Follow me, please. Ah. We finally found you, Cerberus. You're not getting away this time. Hmm? You think you've cornered me. The way I see it, things are all going according to plan. What? Tell me one thing, Zed. How exactly did you manage to get Biko back? I told you over and over that there was no way to do that. And I believed you the whole time. I always thought the only option was to kill Biko. But that lady told me I could save Biko if I destroyed the God of Destruction's core thing. Wait a minute, who is this lady you speak of? Are you two-timing me, Prince Zed? Stop 
butting in. You're just gonna make this more complicated. The lady I'm talking about is the legendary witch. A legendary witch? You met her, Zed? Yeah. I learned how to save Vigo during the final battle. Thanks for fighting at my side, everybody. I only managed to save Biko because of you. I can put an end to everything now. Rest in peace, Biko. With this, it's all over! Zed. Zed. You again? What do you want? Zed, if I told you there was a way to return Biko to her previous form, what would you do? What? Seriously? I'd do anything. I knew you'd say that. I am the one known as the legendary witch, Reliza. The Legendary Witch? I can only remain in this world a little while longer. But before I go, please listen. I will tell you how to save your sister. In return, will you hear my request? No free favors, huh? Whatever. Just tell me what you want. Thank you, Zed. Please stop him. You're the only one who can. I see. So, you met her. You must really want to stop me, Eliza. I was ready to kill Biko and then die myself. But at the last second, I learned how to save her without having to kill her. When Biko told me about your betrayal, I wanted to rip you to shreds. If I did, then everyone would just blame her for being the god of destruction. I needed to make sure the truth was brought to light. So I thought really hard about what to do. I realized that if I called you out in front of everyone at the Darkest Assembly, they would see that Biko was just a victim. Hmm. And here I thought you broke into the place because you were convinced it was Ivar. But it seems that was just an excuse to get me into that packed hall. You did quite well. Considering how rotten your brain is, I'm impressed you were able to set me up at all. I had to think so hard steam was practically coming out of my ears. But it was worth it to help Biko. How audacious of you to drag the Darkest Assembly and myself into your little spat. Hey, Serby. Why'd you do this? Will you please tell me? My answer remains the same. Even if I did explain my reasons, none of you would understand. Serby. Stay back, Biko. Just leave this to us. The strongest sport. in the universe!
impossible. I won't accept this. Removing limiters. Sensors at full capacity. Fire! Mission complete. The word failure isn't in my dictionary. There's no end to them! This is no ordinary summoning spell, is it? Oh, you can tell. I'd expect nothing less from the Witch of the Abyss. These are failures in my quest to create a god of destruction. I didn't want my efforts to go to waste, so I'm reusing them. I can't believe you. Just how rotten are you, Cerberus? You're one to talk. The zombie's really going to call me rotten? Now! Biko! Cerberus! I won't let you hurt her again, you bastard! You left me no choice. I need to get my plan back on track after you forced it off the rails. Serby, I know you really are a nice person. But something really sad happened to you, right? That's why you're doing this. Hush now, Biko. Don't make this any more difficult. Stop right there, Cerberus! Give Biko back, damn it! Biko's in danger! We must give Chase Zed! Duh! I don't need you to tell me that! Softly, I'm. Looking. 